Hi everybody, my name is James and I'm just going to show you how to sign in to Poolhost. You click on the Poolhost link which is www.poolhost.com. I'm already signed in and so it's kept me signed in, but I manage these two sites, uh, James NFL Pick'em 2018-2019, next year it'll be 2019-2020, and then right now we're in the NFL Playoff Challenge. So if you'd signed up for one of those and I can show you how to do that later, you're now in, you click on what we're playing right now, NFL Playoff Challenge, and you can see up here, you want to see results or the season standings or make your picks. So you go to click Make Change Picks. Down here, you see it's the Conference Championships. So, and this is me, the J, so I'm going to select me in this week. These are my picks. I've got New Orleans and, and the Rams. New Orleans is favored by three and a half points so it means when the game starts Los Angeles has its three and a half to nothing when the game starts Kansas City is favored so when the game starts in Kansas City New England will be will have three points that's covering that is the Vegas spread three points three and a half points so I am pretty sure, I'm thinking that New Orleans, and New Orleans is going to be at home too, by the way. So, I'm going to take New Orleans in three and a half, and I'm going to put two points, my, my two points, my confidence points on that. And then on New England and Kansas City, well, boy oh boy, they're in Arrowhead. Man, that's a tough one. I'm going to... I'm going to pick Kansas City, and then the only choice I have left in my weighted confidence points is the 1. So I do that, and now I will save my picks. And then it shows. And you see here, too, when you, when you make your picks, you want to click Save, and then you want to look here and make sure that you've got your confirmation ID. If you've got that showing, you're safe. Then you're... Obviously, you can print out your picks if you want to. This is mine. And I will go on ahead and print this. It says here, save as a PDF. I don't want to do that, so I'm going to change it. I want it to print out of my LaserJet printer. So I will do that and make sure that I just print one page, which is probably all that is. But I want to make sure, and now I hit print. And now that should print on my printer. Hope you enjoyed this. Thanks for watching.